continue. How far you got? I just finished chapter one. So this is the beginning of chapter two. Like just the beginning. I went to chapter, I ended chapter one and then I was like, that's it for today. <laughs> so we are right in the beginning, I would say. I'm very early on. I have some coffee. Cheers. Oh, I can press continue. He didn't have a heart. On the case board. But he still got up. The page predicted all of it. It helped me fight him. Whoa. He, he just disappeared? What the hell is going on here? We need to figure that out if we're going to do anything about it. Somehow we need to make sense of this. It's like my reaction exactly. What the heck was that? We were attack attacked by a dead man. There is no rational explanation to what we just saw. I'd love to blame this on mass hallucination caused by inhaling volcanic gas, but we both know that's bullshit. This was supernatural. Well, I'm glad you were the one to say it. Now we can figure out a way forward. Uh, what happened to the sheriff? Yeah, he just, um, he just disappeared. Just poof. Right? Right before things got crazy, Sheriff Breaker just vanished. Maybe Ice the man. sheriff knew more than he was letting on. Hmm. He seemed anxious, like he dreaded what was coming. One more mystery. Is this the work of the cult? The victim of a ritualistic murder turns into a monster. Is there a connection? Looks to me like the cult of the tree is performing rituals to create monsters. Hmm, maybe. We need to start with learning this cult's goal, their purpose. Interesting. It's funny that Sam Yerevi is Sam Lake for There's interviews. One of the on the floor. I mean, it's hard to say Yerevi in English. Yeah, I don't even know if I pronounced These pages it properly. Are Breaker dropped one before yeah. he disappeared. Yeah, I was gonna say, is it just me or does everything sound a little bit um, kind of like they're in a can? You know what? I'm gonna check. Give me one second. Let's see if it's better. Can I talk to you? Maybe if we go into her mind palace or something, she will talk. Saga mind was place. back at Cauldron Lake. Saga had to pursue Nightingale. Yeah, this into sounds the better. overlap. Finding a way in would be difficult. A ritual. Saga would learn how. Stop the monster. It sounds better, right? It's not just my brain. It was that, um, it's the Windows spatial something something. Oh, thank you. Hey, Titan, how are you? Much better. Oh, this is just so interesting. I'm trying to remember everything from last time we played was uh, almost a week ago. Oh, is that one of those you pee in? Oh, it is, but it's in with blood. <laughs> the heart is gone too. Did the fucker take it with him? I mean, it was his heart, so I guess. Okay, let's go. Control goals. Figure out where Nightingale went. Yeah, and uh, I just realized uh, when I didn't play that Nightingale is in the first game, right? He's um, the FBI. There's an FBI agent in the first game. I remember correctly because I was like I recognize that name but I don't know if it's just because it's a cool name a dead man turned into a monster light as a way to fight him pages predicting the future there's no rational explanation this is the case we must solve hmm it's so hard to not spoil. I totally get that. Sometimes it's difficult. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, I'll put this command in there. Sorry about the screen moving. Uh, I have... <laughs> I ask myself a bunch of rhetorical questions sometimes, and you don't need to answer them. I'm the expert of being like... I wonder how Alan 2... Wake 2 ends. And then someone will be like, oh, it ends with Alan Wake 2 becoming the king of... Uh, Romania and I'm like oh I didn't want to know that <laughs> so we have Saga had to pursue Nath Nightingale into the overlap finding a way in would be difficult and then Saga was back at Cauldron Lake he was ta there too a taken a creature of darkness interesting 
I want a board like this. It's very fun. According to the page, it sounds like Nightingale went back to Cauldron Lake and he's a Taken. The overlap. What? These pages aren't making any sense. I agree. And then we have the Cult of the Tree as well. We have a victim of cult killing became a monster. Or later, a victim's body uh, or guns were covered in writing. Page found inside the chest. <laughs> it's funny titles. Nightingale was the only victim to become a monster. Keep trying. I don't know where that goes. Casey, the cult of the tree is performing rituals to create monsters. Where would this one fit? Here. All right. The autopsy room was a oh. mess, like a bomb oh, had gone off. Oh, this is cool. I didn't know we could Nightingale do this. Nightingale hunted Saga. Hmm. Didn't see her under the light, lurched past her. The Taken could not see into bright light. The light hurt them, hurt the darkness in them, made them vulnerable. I flick the switch, it goes click. Show me the clicker, lights are off, but somebody's home. Hemingway brought you here, witch. Get out of my house, Nightingale shouted. A wave of terror crashed through Saga's head. The awful truth. Nightingale had no heart in his chest, but here he was, killing a monster. The world had lurched out of balance. You found yourself trapped on the far side of the mirror. That's cool. Uh, did you play Control? Yes, I did. It, I, I really loved it. I haven't replayed Control or Alan Wake 1 uh, before playing Alan Wake 2 now. And maybe I should have just to get... Because I don't remember so many parts of the story. I remember Barry. That's about it. <laughs> but I think it's okay to go in kind of unknowing. And then I love these games. So I'm probably going to want to do... Another replay of Alan Wake Remastered, Control, and then Alan Wake 2 again, just to play them in a, like, right after each other. That would be quite fun. We have a radio. Oh! Oh, that's cool. I did play the remake, though, I think two years ago, so it's not that long ago. This song was so nice. Oops. Sorry, my Twitch crashed, which I think is fine. It's just mine. Just check it. Yeah. Oh, that was a very good song. Remaster. Okay, thank you. Yes. We don't need to rewatch Adventure Tours. And we cannot upgrade our weapon yet. I'm not sure how it works if... Um, the music is, you know, uh, gonna trigger a Twitch copyright. I don't, I hope not. Mom may be gone, but whenever I read this, I feel like she's still here. I wanna read it. Saga, for what it's worth, I think it's important that Logan grows up seeing what you do, what you love, what you're great at. That will teach her so much. There will be times just like when this uh when you have questioned your choices your competence even your sanity when things get dark remember to trust and love yourself as much as your family does you won't be perfect but i know you'll be amazing love you always mom oh that's so nice okay that's good to know thank you i was thinking and this is another rhetorical question for y'all i wonder where this place is because the room is oddly familiar but i don't know if that i mean this room also reminds me of like any room from gilmore girls or supernatural so that it could be something just me watching american tv and there's a door out here this one leads out of the mind place and this one's private i guess that's her secrets maybe it's cool all right look around some more the 
The page places Nightingale back at Cauldron Lake. Calls him a Taken. We need to head over there, stop him, before anyone else gets hurt. Okay. I feel slightly rude pointing the flashlight in his face, but I don't remember how I remove it. I don't think I need to remove it. We, we heard gunshots, y'all okay? Did you get spooked by the bodies? Sheriff Breaker disappeared. Nightingale turned into some sort of a monster and there are offices down. You two handle things here. We need to get back to Cauldron Lake immediately. Fuck me. That's terrible. <laughs> yes. We'll do what we can, man. <laughs> no questioning. Okay, well, I'm FBI, so you better listen to me. I know what I'm doing. That's crazy, right, Thorn? Nightingale's heart was missing. How could he do anything? He's dead. I played Resident Evil. I know there's always stuff in the lockers. Right. Well, that's all crazy talk. Monsters aren't real, and <laughs> what do you mean the, the sheriff disappeared? Like poof? Like he's gone like magic? I <laughs> I love how this game is both uh, so goofy and like serious and dark at the same time. I love that. Nice plant. Pair. How do I turn down my flashlight? I feel like F is usually it. That's not it. Hmm. I mean, it doesn't matter much, but. For my immersion, it makes it weird that she's walking around with a flashlight. My client has been held here long enough. Are you gonna let me speak to them or not? Uh, just a moment, ma'am. Someone will be right with you. I'm just curious to what's going on. Okay, no, let's continue. I there's so much. Nightingale to... and his cult are dangerous. We need to be prepared in case things escalate more than they already have. Can you call it in, Casey? A smart choice, Anderson. Yeah, a Agent Casey here. Yeah. We need backup. The Bright Falls case. Whoever you can spare. ASAP. There's so much to do and look at here. I think we'll I actually find Nightingale at the lake? The pages haven't been wrong yet. We can't assume the person writing these pages isn't playing us. I agree. But it's our best lead. Okay, give me one second. I want to know how I remove the flashlight because uh, it bothers me. <laughs> uh, oh, it's unbound. Oh, okay. Is anything bound to F? Yes, interact. Uh, what do we put flashlight on? That's a good question. It's only bound to... Um, Checking which numbers. It says E. Oh, yeah, I just saw this one. Oh, I'm a fool. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Battle Fans. Marisetta won't roll over on the issues. What are the issues? Is it the murders? Oh. AC, wait. Wait for me. I was looking at things. There's so many things to look at here. There's coffee land. There's deer. There's so much stuff. I want to see it all. <sighs> Rinse and repeat. Clock out, get a beer. Or maybe three. Okay, the car, car can be used to travel between locations. I know I'm just supposed to follow him and do whatever I'm supposed to do, but... I'm gonna take a quick look around. Meet you back at the car. I wanna listen to the radio. Oh, it's me.
This is cute. I love when games just have these things you can just stand and wait and relax for a bit. Rain? No. Can I go into the water? Oh. Oh, I can. Probably not great, but that's cool. What are you going to have for dinner? I'm going to have curry. So I would suggest curry for you too because curry is always good. Hey, Katie. Oh, let me move that thing. Here. You know what? Maybe we should actually... Should we hide it? Nah, we can, we can keep it. Oh, Katie, you shut the heck up. Hi. I'm just looking at things. I know I have stuff to do, people to see you, and whatever, but there's just so much to look at. This game, it looks amazing. This town, although Did you check out the, town the horrors, you it's just, just getting so my bearings. cozy. Ready to go? Waiting on you. Go to the bar. Oh, where's the bar? I want to go to the bar. Is this the bar? No, this is the historic Elderwood Palace Lodge of Bright Falls. This building was constructed as part of one of the early settlements in the Great Brighter, Greater Bright Falls area. Bo built in 1898, the building has been both in private and public use through the years and has bravely stood the test of time. In 2015, it was carefully taken apart and relocated here in downtown Bright Falls. Oh, it was rebuilt. Okay, yeah, because th this one was... Um, in another place, in the first game. So what's good here? I remember this. Nice restaurants. A nice a beer. Bit of duty. Well, no, no, no. It's totally okay, Katie. I appreciate hey, input. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> There's no music. You know what? Who needs music? Just dance to the tune of your own mind. That's much better. I love it. Is there music? I don't think so. This guy's eating soup. Soup's nice. It's me when I dance. Same. Same, same, same. Pumpkin. Oh, what's going on back here? So I usually I, I'm <laughs> I'm usually so slow when I play games because I do this. I'm like, oh, what's damp? Oh, that's a nice little tea kettle. Oh, I wonder what tea they brew. Is it green? Is it is it Earl Grey? And then I don't progress in the game, and I've been fighting it. I sometimes I fight against it. I'm like. You're streaming. You need who? You need to progress. You can't just look at tea kettles for two hours. But today we're gonna play as I play. And we're gonna be slow and we're gonna see if we can pet this deer. Rest easy, buddy. Yes, we can. And that's nice. <laughs> there is so much detail and I love it. I, I, I kind of really appreciate when games do things like this. I know it's not for everyone. Not everyone is like that interested in seeing all of these small things, but I enjoy it. I appreciate it. What do we have here? Someone's doing something. Wait. Who's doing this? Maybe we'll learn later. Wait a moment. <laughs> Wait a moment. Hello. Excuse me. This is the same room. Oh, that's interesting. This is my room. And wasn't this place i'm just speculating please do not confirm 
or deny. Wasn't this the therapy place in the first game? I'm pretty sure this is where um, Alan Wake was locked up. I'm uh, I'm solving mysteries. It's not it won't open. Oh, that's wait. Can we see what's in the private room in my room, or is the doors not located in the same spot? Here it says private. Right, so this is the private. No, I can't go in here either. So this is quite interesting, Snow, but I found, you know, in our mind place, I found a room in the real world and she doesn't react to it, which I think is, hey, not a very great FBI agent. <laughs> That's mean, but I'm, I'm starting to guess at what this might mean, but I don't want to uh, say. Yeah, this is definitely where Alan was in one of these rooms. And this place was in control too, no? I'm pretty sure. Oh, beef jerky, yes. Sorry. <laughs> Not related. Yeah. I remember. Oh, that's cool. I don't want to speculate or anything. Cauldron Lake. Look into news and rumors. Focus on 2010. Cross reference with all case files from NYC cult. Similarities, commonalities, and method. Part of series. Find out name of good coffee from diner oh that's the good part which town is this bright falls pacific northwest washington i'm just guessing <laughs> you know these things katie i think you're, you're trying to make me think about something but i don't get it is this it like a hotel budge. now, or people still live here? What is she up to? Hmm. Okay, very, very interesting. All right. You miss it up in other town. Okay. Yeah, sorry. I'm just gonna go check over here. No, 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 no. No worries. You know what? I appreciate help. I'm trying to be more accepting of help because I am bad at accepting help in like all aspects of my life. So help and suggestions are appreciated as long as you kind of let me think a little bit. It's closed for myself too because I like solving puzzles and mystery and if someone just helps me with everything, then I, I like to think a bit as well. But I am absolutely open to spoiler free hints, yes. Exactly. I'm not sure where the bar is at. Oh my gosh, this town is huge. It's not really small actually, but <laughs> from like a game perspective, it, it reminds me a little bit of the town in Evil Within 2, but I think that's also just a case of both of the places looking like American towns. And I've never been in an American town, so that's just... Um, like how I think towns look. <laughs> Deadly premonitions. Ooh, I haven't played that. All I see is the life is strange town. Yeah, that too. Yeah. Bright Falls Sheriff Station. Okay. I think we're gonna continue. Otherwise, like I could stay here for hours. But uh, we have actually we have murder murders to fix. This looks exactly like my backpack. Except mine has foxes and raccoons on it. But like the shape. Yeah, I'm gonna I go check something out. <laughs> be right back. Got it. Samyeri wanted to be a ghost storybook writer. Oh, interesting. Like, a, not a ghost writer, but he wanted to write ghost stories? Is that what you mean? Konkin, yes. I love that bag. Expensive but durable. Oh, okay. Coffee. 
I need to come clean, Anderson. Mm -hmm. I know why Nightingale was here 13 years ago. He was chasing a writer, Alan Wake. Tammy mentioned him. She's writing a book on his disappearance. You know the detective character from his books, Alex Casey. Yeah, I've heard the jokes at the office. Cold Case Casey. Murder Case Casey. <laughs> Sorry. Ha uh ha. -huh. The same name, similar job. It's the first thing anyone thinks of. It annoyed me, but that was it. Then, ten years ago, I started getting strange letters in the mail. Fragments of prose describing murders. You've heard the stories about what happened in New York. Some of it, at least. Bodies started to pile up. It was a murder cult. Turns out the fragments sent to me were from the crime books of Alan Wake. The cult was copycatting the murders from the books. Mm. In their heads, they were performing a ritual to bring Wake back. Their imagined prophet. After that case, I started looking into Wake's disappearance on the side. And you thought this case might be connected to him? His name does keep popping up. I just wanted you to have all the facts. Next time, give them to me before we find ourselves in the middle of a horror story. Yes. <laughs> That's interesting. Huh. Yeah, I have love dice as well. Oh, the pretty fall leaves. Such a good fall game too, sorry. <laughs> I just, I love it. The heart. Return to the heart. The page says Nightingale's in something called an overlap. Need to figure out exactly what that means. I'm happy I'm not in charge of this mess. Thanks. Let's start looking for Nightingale where he was killed. Do we know what Casey's first name is? I guess we do. Oh, look, that's so pretty. <laughs> that's so pretty, Alex. It is, so it is like the real Casey's name is also Alex. I guess it doesn't matter which way we go. Or I probably should follow him. Oh, let me turn off. I always have flux on and I always forget to turn it off for games. Uh, it's uh, it's an app that just makes my screen a little bit more yellow so that I can sleep easier. But we don't need it to be yellow now. The writer of these pages knows what will happen mm -hmm. because they're behind this okay. or because they can see what's coming. Thank you. Impossible things are happening here. A world operating on different rules. I need to understand this strange logic. To see the clues. To solve the case. Oh, look how pretty it is. Oh, I just, can you just imagine walking down this beautiful path in sunset, in this light? I mean, I know we're solving a murder case, but so cozy. Your jacket looks comfortable as well. I've been thinking more about the cold of the tree. What sort of cult refers to themselves as a cult? <laughs> True. <In my> experience, <laughs> That's they funny. Don't. We're not seeing the full picture yet. If this was Life is Strange, I could sit on this bench and just look, the, look at the sunset for a while. Hey, Donner. Yeah, isn't that kind of funny? Like, we're a cult. You want to join? Hey, hello there. Hello. How are you folks doing? Those restricted area signs don't do it. Are you authorized to be here? Hello. Saga Anderson. Are you two supposed to be here? I'm Ilmo Koskela. Oh, yeah, it's Fantastic him. Fantastic to meet you. From the TV yes, show. Stephen here hired me to show him through the woods. He's in town on important government business. Fixing this impressive piece of hardware. I work for the FBC, man. I'm authorized <laughs> to be here. And I bet you two are here about that murder. Nasty stuff. How's it going? You know about the murder? How did you hear about the murder, Ilmo? Do you know anything that could help us? People tend to tell me things. The Koskala brothers are kind of a household name around here. Speaking of, 
Uh, if you're looking for some fun, stop by Watery. Just down the road from Bright Falls, there's our Coffee World Amusement Park. There's sauna, sauna de vista. <laughs> and we offer a variety of guided tours, hunting, fishing, hiking, whatever strikes your fancy. You name it, we probably got it. Oh, really, to be here? That's cool. How did he get him in the game? That's, that's, that's really nice. What is this machine? What is this thing? It's just a monitoring station, ma'am. The Federal Bureau of Control checks volcanic activity and air toxicity levels. No need to worry, though. It's mostly for research purposes. That's one gorgeous weather saga. <laughs> Looks Nordic. I bet a family member made it. It does! Didn't I say that? No, I don't think I said that. But I, 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 it does look Nordic. My mother made this sweater for me. And yeah, control, How yes. How do you know? I knew it. My mom used to knit those sweaters for me and my brother. Watery, my hometown, was founded by Finnish immigrants. So between your name and the sweater, I figured your family might be from Finland too. Suomi, Finland. Mulla, Karjalan piirre. Klaus, my mom's family is from Sweden originally. I don't know much about them beyond that. The sweater is just something to remember her by. You can see when she was like, no, my family was from Finland. His face is just like, okay. <laughs> the Federal Bureau of Control, sorry. Steven, we're investigating a murder that occurred nearby. What can you tell me about your bureau? Nothing that isn't classified, I'm afraid. But I don't know anything about a murder. Operations here are run by a different department. I'm just here to make some repairs. The wiring on this thing frays every couple months. Yep, that's the raccoons. They grow real big here with teeth like you wouldn't believe. Can not run through a garbage can. That's all I've got for the moment. What does that mean? Pudla in Swedish is not an what the hell is this? appropriate what word. Her, That's why I'm uh, nothing. asking. <laughs> be here. I don't want to say what it means. I'm just gonna snoop. Clear signs of tampering. Signal was rerouted into a transmitter that is not one of ours. I fixed it so any alerts will come our way, but it's definitely concerning. I'll make a report for the investigations department. Leaving this here in case I'm not next, not the next person to fix these things. If you're reading this, check for tampering. We may want to put more secure metal casings around the whole thing so that the raccoons can't get to it anymore. Stephen Lin, chief technician. Finska pinna. Is that what it means? Like the candy? Or not the candy, but the... Yeah. Hmm. Oh. There's something. No, okay, okay. Yeah, we looked at this one before. It's the same one. Oh, but... Was this here before? I feel like I would have noticed it, but maybe it was. I didn't think about it. Ah, okay. Let's get to the murder site, Casey. Let's go, Casey. Oh, look at that. A lot of things about this case keep covering like a me. tunnel. Cool. But one thing feels really off. Breaker's disappearance. I don't get the feeling Nightingale was responsible. Hmm. He was about to give you more of those pages. Something didn't want us to have them? Or was protecting him from Nightingale? Spontaneous combustion? I don't know. I, not the kind of disappearance we normally solve. Hmm. Oh, Piroge. Okay. Dark house. Our crime scene's drowning. I never minded rain. Feels like home. No sign of Nightingale. But the page did place him at Cauldron Lake in an overlap. So how do we follow him there? Maybe something around here will tell us. Hmm. This is the second time he says something about rain. 
something positive We've about seen Rain. Symbol before. Does that mean hmm. something? Or is he just Lie. weird? I'm kidding. <laughs> it's okay to like Rain. I like Rain. I just don't like being out in the rain. Bare feet. Ooh. Nightingale. I'll oh, see where these that's footprints creepy. Lead. Can you come through the crime scene one more time, KC? Just in case. On it. If anything comes up, I'll radio you. Do you see that the footprints have that weird, like, wooshy, galichy appearance that the monsters in Alan Week 1 had? I mean, this guy is also a monster, so... Makes sense. Oh, it's so... I mean, this the whole area, it feels like it's crafted with such detail. I love it. But then, also, you know... That's just what the forest looks like. I went to a forest on a forest walk today and I just love the forest. And the forest itself looks like it's just carefully crafted, but it's just how that's just what forests are like. But still. Ooh, I just sorry, just curious what's over here. Or am I going in a circle? No? Oh, big light. Huh. Raining. I'm gonna turn up the volume a little bit because the rain sounds so cozy. Alex Casey is based on the character of Max Payne's, and I suppose it rains a lot in those Max Payne's games. Oh, okay. Monday 9th. Oh, this is 3rd September. Uh, some suspicious activity spotted. The fielder thought he saw movement in the bushes footprints around the area were found but some were compromised by the fielder note to self train the fielder 4th september nothing to report some animals regular 5th september hunters out after dark poachers heard some gunshots not one of ours gotta keep an eye off on these people they could get more than they bargained for out here out there okay is this like a laundry place hey casey What's the forest's favorite shape? Please, Anderson. Just one case without the rented... A triangle. <laughs> yes, you do. It's stupid, I like it. Oh. Large amount of supplies. What am I looking at here? Okay. Weird that it's zoomed in like that. Thank you for shopping here. So this was a shop but definitely isn't anymore someone was camping out here oh i like is it called environmental storytelling when you can see here that someone's been camping here they were playing coat poker they have a bunch of walkie talkies maybe they were hunters that is that environmental storytelling they have a guitar I don't know, I just like that when you can see things and you're like, hmm, look, they, they had food, so they stayed here for a while, probably. It's nice. Where does this go? Door. Hmm. Oh, and I read that, and they were taking notes. Out into the rain. I just want to see what's under big lamp maybe it's nothing who would live in such a condition i mean i wouldn't mind it for a bit i think as long as there's internet <laughs> let's go down and hey bruh winnie the winnie poo <laughs> i believe that's the term yeah did it just rain here or does it rain everywhere now weird thing to ask still asking it Oh yeah, he's going back the same route as we walked in the intro of the game. Do you remember when we were playing as Nightingale? He walked exactly this way, I'm pretty sure. Because I remember looking at those boxes back there then too. Oh, what was that? I'm getting oh. flashbacks. I'm getting goosebumps. Remember Ohio? Sure. The North Side Slasher. But that case was completely different. The trees, Anderson. He hid the bodies in the forest. Well, that's creepy. I'm just glad. Yesterday we played horror games all day. 
And this is sort the of a horror game, but it's not it, as scary. Where'd you go from here? It's nice. <laughs> to oh my gosh! I can feel something. A presence. Did it have to do that just when I said it wasn't so scary? <laughs> that is so mean. <laughs> the timing. Oh gosh. What is I'm I'm very curious again, rhetorical question, as always. I always ask rhetorical questions. What is happening with the water? Why is the lake rising? That is connected, I'm pretty sure. I don't like that you're giving giving me bullets right now because that's probably not a good sign. <laughs> Oh, you jumped too? I'm glad I'm not alone. It was so cozy in the forest, I forgot that this is actually slightly scary. Oh, the witch's ladle. Oh, oh yeah, this it's ra racing all around here. Interesting. And here. Oh, what's that? What that? These aren't the same tracks that were here before. They're headed into the tree, not out of it. Go into the tree! You can toggle the flashlight boost to increase damage to darkness and burn through dark substance. Okay. My flashlight burned the dark stuff away. Oh, that's so cool. It was covering another page. Remember the symbol on the lower left? I do not remember it, but I can, I can put it in my memory. The fuse was in place. Saga stepped into the witch's hut. Inside, a bright light. There were objects that stood out to Saga, as if the light had manifested them. The witch's hut. Okay. I trust the pages to lead me to the overlap. Hmm. So now we need to locate the witch's hut. Unfortunately, I already found it, because I was running around before the last time. Okay, let's look in our mind place. Oh, it got so quiet. I don't like that. I want to read manuscript pages, please. Oh, if I thought Alan was going to read them for me, but okay. Uh, the fuse was... Oh, yeah, this is... Uh, uh, almost what she... Well, what he just read. Uh, the fuse was in place. She had found it among the junk in the forest. Saga, Saga stepped inside the witch's hut. Something rushed through her, a presence, familiar. She couldn't quite place it, something long forgotten. She tried to hold on to it, but it was already gone. Inside, a bright light and, and object stood out to Saga, stood out from the dusty animal skulls and cauldron as if the light had manifested them. Pulled from darkness, a shift in reality, heavy with hidden mess meanings, a coffee firm thermos, a shoebox, a mop and bucket, a poster on the wall, and in the cabinet, another mag manuscript page. Oh, here we have the profiling on Nightingale. The overlap. I know Nightingale is somewhere around Cauldron Lake. The tree was a threshold. This place... And the dark place. <laughs> You're in over your head. Next stop, Caldera Street Station. The threshold, like a doorway, leading to Nightingale. It's somehow connected to a tree, which is ladle. Hmm, okay. We have more uh, radio things and adventure tours oh i didn't, don't know if i heard this one i don't think we did i'm not gonna listen to it uh just in case there's some copyright or whatever um but i'll probably if, if the, the whole game soundtrack is on spotify i'll definitely download it to my phone because i i like all of it Okay, so now we need to locate the witch's hut. And I know where it is, if I can remember which direction. Here. I know where it is. 
there isn't copyright music in this whole game. That's nice. Yeah, it's it's their own music, right? Oh, it's just leaves. See, I have a battery for the flashlight too. Where did I? Here. Witchfinder Station. Oh, can I walk over this? No. It's like a block. Okay. I'm like, where did I? Where did I come from? I think here. Yeah, and then we go up here. Oh, I heard uh, weird noises. This is the witch's hut. Like that. Anderson, thought I saw something in the woods. Yeah. Probably just a deer, but I'm gonna check it out. Okay, I found another page. Following up on a lead. Keep checking in. Roger. The page described the hut being lit, and mentioned a fuse. Hmm. Here's a rope. This is kind of creepy now. Yeah, right. Is a deer with only the skull. Coffee views. I guess we have to look outside. We read this before, but we can read it again. Here lived the witch of Cauldron Lake, but where her spirit may still haunt this place. Okay, let's hope she doesn't. It's just the windows that are knocking, if you're wondering gonna check over here see what this is this fuse is busted Damn. oh someone's been sitting here this reminds me of in fallout 4 where you find this is a bit of a spot now I'll, I'll wear this with this in the fallout 4 spoiler just in case but there is um when you get out of the vault in the beginning of Fallout 4 in an area, you can say, find that someone's been sitting like this and spying on your character for a while, which is interesting. This one looks good. People should really stop littering, though. They should. Hey, Svern, how are you? Yeah, we're playing another spooky game. <laughs> Friday. Midge told me that her family is moving away. This sucks. I haven't even told her that I like her yet. What's the point anymore? She said her parents want to get better jobs and get her to a better school in a big city. I guess that's fair. Who wants to stay in bright fucking falls? Sunday. So I told her. She said thanks. <laughs> fucking kill me. Oh no. That sucks. So he, this person, they liked Midge. And they told Midge, hey, I like you. And Midge said, thank you. <laughs> that is not such a nice response to get. Monday, I snuck out last night. I went to the big house by the lake. Instead of just watching it from here like I always do, odd. Uh, instead of just sitting around like I always do. Screw that. Anyway, something weird is going on down there. I'm going to find out what. Going to go back there tomorrow with better gear. I bet I can find a way inside the building. It takes some photos. It's gonna be epic. Okay, I'm guessing he didn't because there's no more entries. And he doesn't seem to be a lunchbox around. again. Who's leaving these out here? Oh, it it looks like kind of like a fairy circle. No, it's like a different pattern. Weird colored rocks. Or are they knit? It's interesting. I know things can get a little crazy around here, but if you're ever feeling scared, just remember that Alan is watching over us. Is he though? Oh, Easter eggs. Yeah, they look like Easter eggs. You're right. They look like they're painted to look like eggs. That's funny. Thank you for pointing that out. I didn't get that. Hmm. Oh, and here, let's put the fuse in the fuse box. It's not a horror game if it doesn't have a fuse. <laughs> like, horror games really overestimates the amount of times you need to find fuses. A 
Oh, the break room is a place where you can save your progress. Oh, okay. Another cool. page. Making progress. So the break room, it actually looks different when the lamp is lit. This reminds me of something, but I'm not sure what. The image of the witch in the sign. Saga addressed the witch. The smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. Interesting. What kind of cookies we got? Oh, those are pirog pirog pirogis, right? Looks like it. Uh, let's do a manual save. Why not? Just want to see what else is around here. But I turn off the flashlight. Like that. They are the yeah. That's cool. What what is in them? Uh, if you people who have eaten them don't mind telling me, what they do look really good. Is it cheese? Or just egg? Or something else? I want to make pierogies. I I did that once in the past. And they're very good. And it's not that hard. And it's so nice to just put them in the freezer and then you can just pick them up and then boom, you have pierogies. Right, I need to go back to the case board. Probably shouldn't have left her out in the dark. We have more lunch boxes. boxes. Uh, the note inside mentions Alan. Alan Wake, what the hell are these? Good question. I, I have a bit of a guess. Or not a guess, but the just cold a of thought. the trees behind these murders. I'll pause it. This case just became much more complicated. I'll need to start a new file. But it's my first cold case. Exciting. <laughs> That's good. Not a lone killer, but an organized group. The cult of the tree. This case got more interesting. I should open a new file. Start fresh. <laughs> hmm. Okay. The page from so the much hut seems to be describing some kind of ritual. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Tubir. I appreciate that. Thank you. What is the ritual? She squinted to read the smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory. I brought you the heart witch. Show me the terror. <sighs> to get into the overlap, I need to find Nightingale's heart. Hmm. Read the line imprinted on it, plus the line on the page to the witch's ladle sign. Then push the heart through the hole in the sign. Rye bread and rice, you butter them up with a butter mix with boiled eggs. Hmm. from the morgue. Where is it now? Oh, py pierogi is already plural. Don't need an S in the end. Oh, thank you. That's nice. I find that pierogi is hard to say. It's, we say we say pierogi in Swedish, <laughs> which is like slightly different pronunciation. And it's hard to remember which one to use. <laughs> so thank you. Witch's ladle, towering over Saga. This is the same we just her heard, right? Witch. The image of the witch in the sign, Nightingale's heart, a cold, dead lump in her what hand. Is it? Her definition of sanity had changed since she arrived in I this don't town. Think so. But she trusted the pages, was forced to. Saga addressed the witch. She squinted to read the first part of the ritual words, the smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory, the words she had read on the page. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. This was the key. The tree was the threshold. It's Alan Wake. Well, I know that. <laughs> and he's obviously, like, going back to what we know, he's obviously still writing a story. And it's coming true. But, and I'm guessing his purpose, unless he's just gone mad for writing the story, is maybe to have someone come and get him out of there. That's what I would guess. Back to profiling on Nightingale. I need Nightingale's heart to get to the overlap. 
Where is it? The cultist leaned close. He was there, but he was risen. Nightingale was there. The opposite of sunspots. Who said that? That's not it. I don't have what I need to find Nightingale's heart. There must be more. Nightingale's heart. Where is it? Meanwhile, they played cards in the general store. The witch had stolen his heart. Get out of my house. Nightingale's oh, heart is at the general store, in a fridge. Okay, yeah, that's where we were. Oh, so there was the cult who was there, okay. Interesting. He's sane? I'm not so sure about that. I'm not so sure he was very sane in the first game <laughs> to begin with. <laughs> I need to check the general store for the heart. Don't forget to save often. Casey, okay, I'm sure. headed to the general store. I think I know how to get into the overlap. Uh, roger that. I followed some ATV tracks in the woods and got a bit turned around. Did you get lost? I've only been lost once in my life, Anderson. The years I spent with my ex-wife. Wow. I'll find my way back, don't you worry about it. I wonder if there's something going on between Saga and Casey. I don't get the feeling that there is. I feel like they're very platonic. Oh, what was that? Huh. Let's jog. So the general store was over here. It's making noise. Don't like that. Oh, shit. Oh. Deer, did you notice how I did not yell at or scream at the deer? Because I had so much practice yesterday when we were playing the don't scream game. I feel like a real Oops, improved. And they have deer faces. Oh shit, oh Okay, that didn't. A cultist, a monster, like Nightingale. I think about using a trauma pad that allow you to heal. Is it this grip? <sighs> nice. I'm here for stress and panic. I'm doing so good, I think. I feel very calm still. I think it's maybe because of yesterday's practice. Uh, all right, this guy just materialized from nowhere. Wait, sorry, don't do that. I just wanna look at his face. Deer mask, big beard, clearly dead, I think. What's the difficulty level? I'm on normal. Okay, fridge. Do we have the fridge? Ah. The text on the heart is clearer now. Legible. The wave crashed on the far side of the mirror. Okay. Now we have a clue. Uh, which is it? Profiling clue? No, we just got more for the case board. Okay, yeah, we don't need to do that right now. She said legible, that is easier to read. I feel like I recognize this. The fridge, the heart. I knew it would be here, like I saw it in a dream. Where did you put the heart? <laughs> just in your pocket? <laughs> and now I need to give the heart to the witch. Makes total sense. Oh, a shotgun? Check with Lady Fortuna at the counter. Okay, whoops. Keep accidentally going into the mind place.
Yeah, <laughs> you're right. She's not a great FBI agent. I wonder if she actually is an FBI agent or if she's just a person who's being written into the role of FBI agent thanks to Alan Wake. Lady Fortuna at the counter. It's not Lady Fortuna. Ah. 7.05, 7 7.13, oh, is, uh, so it's 7.25, is that it? Wait, yeah, 7.25. Lotto Washington. Madame Agnieszka's palm reading and crystal gazing interpreter of dreams. Oh, interesting. Do you believe in dream interpretations? I'm not sure I do, but I, I like the idea of it. Okay, 7.25. No? It's not 7.25? I was pretty sure it would be 7.25. But also, I'm not so good at math. Wasn't it 720? Let's go back. <laughs> Let's uh, check that again. It's funny because dreams are awake representations. Oh, true. Wait. Because I... Oh. Wait, what? 705 713 seven, seven. So it's Ah 739 I see. I don't know how I got to the other number. There we go. Thank you for the shotgun. I don't like the achievements, <laughs> I have to say, but it's okay. But I'm not an achievement person, so I think that's why we have here bullets. Oh, can I? How do I assign things? Not there. Oh, not like that. Here, can I assign? Quick slot one. Quick slot two. Thank you. All right, so now we need to find a witch No. Oh, I see we have stuff to do. All right. Case board. Where is the heart? The heart is here. Words on the heart are legible now. Sounds literary, but what does it mean? Found the heart in the fridge, just like the page said I would. And the words on the page on the heart was the wave crashed on the far side of the mirror. I brought you the heart, which show me the terror. No. Yeah, the the wave crashed on the far side of the mirror. Yeah. Saga edged toward the broken door, her gun ready, flashlight aimed ahead. Nightingale said it would be here. The Cauldron Lake General Store was overgrown, left to rot. Saga thought about the cult of the tree. They'd been here, waiting, planning a gruesome ritual murder. Meanwhile, they played cards in the general store, like it was just another late night poker game. Saga stepped closer to the door. Had the animal broken it? There was a loud crash. Saga found herself face to face with a cultist, a hulking figure in a raincoat. 
We watch in the night. Wild eyes behind a plastic deer mask. An axe in his raised hand. Hmm. Okay, so that's just what happened. Alright. And now... We need to... Place the heart in the witch's sign. So back... Casey, there are cultists in the area. They're taken, like Nightingale. Watch yourself out there. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. I'm still finding my way back. Yeah, can you, you write a, a rom-com, maybe? <laughs> uh, any city in America I can get through drunk and blindfolded. It's these damn trees. Okay, okay. I'm en route to Witch's Ladle. I need to perform a ritual to open the overlap. This case just keeps getting weirder. But it is exciting. Am I on route to Witch's Ladle, though? We'll figure it out. Easy's lost in the woods. <laughs> Witch's Hut. Please. Yeah, here's the hut. And then we go down to the ladle. That's cool. So the cauldron or which is oh save yes thank you thank you thank you thank you. So the ladle is the big tree and the cauldron is the lake. This is the hut. I'm just gonna do a quick save. Get some pierogi. And then move on. <laughs> well, he said he said he has a difficulty with trees, so. <laughs> Little coffee, yeah. The game looks so good, don't you think? I feel like I'm not having super smooth 60 FPS all times, but also, oh, hello. It doesn't really matter. Oh, why wasn't I? Oh, I thought it was in the light, but it stopped working. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, I died. <laughs> uh, this is not how the story goes. It says behind my webcam. Not supposed to die. Yeah, I I wish it was a little better. Um, run run ran a little bit better, so it was a little bit smoother. Honestly, it's not much to complain about. I'm just being very picky. This is a preview for the upcoming Black Friday sales. Is that a big thing in in uh, where all of you live too? You know what? Let me just turn off. Um, some things on my computer. Scam fest here. It, it is a little bit here too. It's very hard to find actually good deals. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> survival horror game. No ammo? Okay, that's fine, because I killed all of them. Oh, uh, there has to be... I think I, there has to be a be better way of killing them, no? I don't think I'm doing it right. Oh well.
Which way? This way. Here it is. This is the sign. Yes, push the heart through the witch. The witch. Fun filming Casey, I think I'm in the overlap. Are you still on your way? Casey! Casey, do you read me? Fuck. I would have been surprised okay, if the... Going in solo. Walkie-talkie worked cross dimensions. <laughs> or whatever. Oh, there it is. Wow! Okay. Logan? Mom, help. Logan! Where are you? What the fuck was that? Logan's back in Virginia. You're imagining things. I'm walking in a circle. At least not a um, forest cozy again. Do I walk back? Because I, I did show up here. I didn't show up in it. So I guess I walk through it again. Let's try. Oh, that's so cool. Game saved, nice. Alan? What was that? It's a ghost. <laughs> Wait. Did I get turned around? Oh, no, this yeah. is right. Interesting. This place is looping. Like a nightmare. It's the last of my batteries. Manuscript page? Let me read it. Need to find Nightingale. Witch's ladle. Towering over Saga. Watching her and the witch. Mm. The image of the witch in the sign. Nightingale's heart, a cold, dead lump in her hand. We already heard this. Her no? definition of sanity had changed yeah. since she arrived in this town. Mm. But she trusted the pages. Was forced to. Saga addressed the witch. She squinted to read the first part of the ritual words, the smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory, the words she had read on the page. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. This was the key. The tree was the threshold. I just wanted to hear it again if there was any more information. Alan sounds a little lot like Gale. No, he doesn't. And I know because Gale's voice actor <laughs> shows up all the time on my TikTok and I'm like, Gale! <laughs> and they don't sound alike. Gale is a lot more British. <laughs> yeah, I don't think they sound like, despite that, maybe, I don't know. I don't think they're super similar. Or 
I really like both voices though. We need to do a romancing Gale playthrough. We need to. Oh, please uh, let me just e e explore and uh, play in my own uh, pace. I like just looking and see if there's anything I'm missing. As mentioned before, I know I'm incredibly slow. Oh shit. Crows. And the red blinking lights. Oh, before we jump in, I hear my laundry is done, so I'm just gonna go get it. <gasps> you know what? I think I'm gonna do this. I think I'm gonna remove uh, chat from stream as well. Um, so I'm removing the chat a bit, also in case um there is some spoilers i don't think there, there is i don't i'm not i don't think there's gonna be any but just in case then um you won't see it on screen in case someone's staying, trying to stay away as well oh that's so creepy oh wow Writer was writing again. Oh, you're cooking dinner. Good luck. I hope, I hope it turns out really Not well. Again. Oh, there's something here. What's that? Oh, really? That's funny. Another manuscript page. Do we want to read it right away? Yeah, we do. It has to be this one? Witch's ladle. Towering over no? Saga. Stop. Watching her and the witch. <laughs> this is not <clears throat> it. Oh, we got it, but it didn't show up. Uh, maybe it's not part of this. Hmm. I want to finish this game soon so that I can start playing Spider Man 2. Oh, yeah. Spider Man 2 <laughs> seems really great. Trapped Who escape. is that? It's Alan. It's like they're coming in over a bad signal. <laughs> wow. And these cult symbols, I guess. It's down here. Hmm. Waterfall. Waterfalls are nice. Oh, there he was. Did you see him? Oh, that's scary. Show me the clicker. What are you talking about? Really cool tunnel. Now we're in a cave. I'm kind of low on health. I think I'm just gonna uh, amend that quickly. <laughs> just realized that was really cool, right? I'm not ready for a boss fight. I don't have any batteries. Oh, or ammo. Oh shit. Oh, sorry to mess around in this tense moment, but the aim sensitivity needs to be a little bit higher. Oh, that was just... Did I do the same? I guess so. Okay, let me uh, run around and see if there's ammo anywhere. <laughs> Here we go. Where is 
see. I can see anything. Oh. Any... I have one full battery. That's good. Yeah, I wonder how they did it. I, it looked like it was... Like, overlaid. I have no idea, but... Oh, oh! I timed it. I timed it wrong. Oh, shit. He is scary. Yeah, I'm playing on normal. I think, I think I need to put that on a quick toggle because it's very hard to look in your inventory when you're being chased. <laughs> okay. Oops. Uh, let me quick slot that to three. Perfect. And then. We should be able to... Yeah, that's nice. <sighs> the upcoming part was one of my favorite parts of the game. I typed this when you first entered the tree, where you're at now. Oh, okay. It is very cool. Very witchy. I agree. Ooh. Did you see that dodge? I did it! <laughs> I thought that it was gonna dodge automatically. Um, but it definitely doesn't, like you need to time it. I felt like as long as you press dodge it will work. It does not. <laughs> here that's unfortunate shit run wait okay yes all right I, I looked away and I didn't see what happened but I think he exploded and I'm running in the other direction that sounds uh Good idea. More ammo, more health pack. Let's use that actually. Alright. I think actually the... Um, I'm not sure. I think the flashlight maybe charges on its own. But I'm not sure. Oh! Shit! <laughs> I, I, got, I got scared so I stopped running. Not the way. Where is he? Hello? Oh, I don't like that. Where did you go, Nightingale? Did he disappear? Oh, he just popped out of the, the stone wall. Oh, that's scary. <laughs> Oh, I can't see anything. 
is very <laughs> difficult. Gosh. I'm out of health packs. And shotgun ammo. That's no good. No. Oh, it's so difficult. Oh, this part freaks you out because it's a bit claustrophobic. Yeah, I can I can see that. And yet, Katie is part of the official, I guess, playtesters of this game, which is so cool! So, that's pretty awesome. Alright, which... Um, let's try this again. Oh, are we trying it... Oh, all the way from the beginning? This is very difficult! Uh, quick slotted, free... Let's use it first... All right. <laughs> Again. I think I need to be more careful with where I aim, since I can run out of ammo. Oh, crap. Oh my gosh, immediately getting stomped. Oh! oh. Okay, you need to run. Saga. I didn't expect it to be so difficult. This is so normal. <laughs> there is a, an easier mode too. But I would like to see if I can get it. Oh, I got something else this time. Well, this is going really bad. I don't think I need any advice at this moment because I feel like the advice is just stop sucking. <laughs> Dodge better. <laughs> um, and I'm, 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 I'm working on it. I can, oh, I keep pressing the wrong button for inventory. I can promise you I'm working on it. I didn't expect the boss fight. Oh, it's so hard to time it! This is not your house, this is the woods, sir. They belong to everyone, or actually, maybe they don't. That's why you should have Aleman's red. Oh, is it R&D? What's in the... But yeah, it is claustrophobic for sure. I said I was gonna be more careful with the ammo. Gotta move. Now. But I'm not... <laughs> I'm not more careful. <laughs> I'm panicking. Did I not get any health? Oh crap. One mistake and I'm dead. Okay, I'll come back there later. No, don't do that. <laughs> what? How long is your tree, sir? No ammo? Okay, fine. Just give me uh that was not too helpful. <laughs> oh sorry. <laughs> I 
Okay, show your, show me your face, please. Sir Nightingale, sir. Sir, I'm like, <laughs> oh. Where is he? I don't see him and that's worse. Is he invisible? Oh, I didn't pick up the pills! No! Please! Yep, um, keep running. Oh. When he says witch, it sounds like a bitch and I don't like it. Oh! I just spam click. I have heal. Heal, but I don't I can't I don't think I can use it. I don't think I can use it <laughs> Maybe if I lose him oh crap, yeah, I, I feel very Locked in and this Oh no 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 is the best defense or something <laughs> Alan Who are you What is this Who are you Did you hear me I'm Saga Anderson FBI I can hear you Cauldron Lake. Yes, sir. I'm at Cauldron Lake. Where are you? I to escape. In danger. The dark presence. Danger. Thanks. Got it. Are you okay? Oh, no! It's my fault! They cut out with my face! Scratch! Sir, calm down. I'm gonna need you to take a breath. He's... he's changed the story. The d dark presence. We must stop it before... Easy now. First things first. What's your name? My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. I, I've been... Wake? Where did you come from? You've been missing for 13 years. 13. That's so cool. That was him. He looks kind of like Obi-Wan, don't you think? A little bit. <laughs> 